Okay, so this this machine is just so amazing. I am so happy. I didn't quite set it up the way the picture had it. They had it where the spool was on this side. But the fact that the tread was coming over made it hard to um, set up the bobbin initially. So I tried this and I think it works a lot better. I positioned the arm like this because it it was wiggling around otherwise so this is not wiggling around anymore um, I had to set it for height but I'm really happy with it and so far I have yet to sew using the bobbins but so far I'm pretty sure that sorry I'm just I need my both my hands for this I'm losing the phone Okay. So, yeah, so cut the excess thread and then look at this. This is I'm just so happy like it hasn't budged and it's not even screwed on so like it's a lot quieter than using that machine because uh, there's a bobbin threader on there but using that uh, makes a lot of noise the machine shakes around because full speed on that machine is not great and the one thing that I really hated about it was that I had no way of controlling the tension that went on the thread of the bobbin because if I tried like for example I could wind the thread multiple times around this thing and that would cause tension but then the motor didn't have enough strength to pull, to to turn the the bobbin when I did that so I I was I couldn't add more pre tension but with this I can so this is to raise the height this is for the tension and I'm I'm just I'm super happy. This is like I gave myself Christmas in in July. <laughs> I'm I'm just so happy. Uh this is going to help a lot to wind up all, all the bobbins for when I work. Um I usually prefer metal. I use a plastic one for the video cuz I figured that would help. But yeah, I am I am super happy. Um so Yay!